Hello, my name is Tony. I'm going to show you how to fix a broken cigar. Before we get started, there's a few things you'll need to gather. From the store, some pectin. There's a few different varieties, most of them will work just fine. A spray bottle that allows you to spray as opposed to stream. And a sacrificial cigar, the cigar we will cannibalize to fix your rear cigar. You'll also need a teaspoon, a smaller of the two spoons, some kind of a cutting device like a knife, some paper towels, and a cigar cutter. The cigar cutter needs to be big enough so your sacrificial cigar fits all the way inside. Ready? Let's get started. The first thing we're going to do is mix our pectin, which is the goma or cigar glue. Take three teaspoons of water, and one teaspoon of pectin. Be careful, this is almost like toner. It's a very fine powder and gets everywhere. So again, three to one. You want to mix this thoroughly until all the bubbles are out, as if though you're making pancakes. Next thing you want to do is take your sacrificial cigar and wet it down. Just spray it down so that it's nice and wet. Grab your cigar cutter and cut about an inch off the end. You don't want any of the cap to be left on the cigar. Keep spraying it down. You want the cigar to be completely wet. We'll let that sit for a minute and I'll show you how to make sure this cigar is actually broken and not just has cosmetic damage. You take the foot of it and draw in. If you have a lot of resistance and you get almost no air, the cigar is fine. If you can draw through it, it's broken. We're going to make sure it's broken. We go back to our sacrificial cigar and you go to the head of the cigar and what you want to do is you want to find where the wrapper starts and where the wrapper starts you just kind of push that out with your thumb and start to take the wrapper off. You may try to do it more gently than is necessary. It's actually a pretty sturdy leaf. For the purposes of this exercise we're going to use a darker tobacco leaf to repair a lighter cigar so you can see them as I'm working on it. I have the wrapper started and what I do is just take it out so I can set it down, make sure there's plenty of water and just unroll the cigar. And as you unroll the cigar the wrapper leaf stays behind. This is the wrapper leaf, you're just going to throw that away. You're going to set the wrapper leaf in front of you, wet it down a little bit. There will be horizontal lines on the veins. You want to put those veins horizontal to your stomach. Then you want to take your broken cigar and start towards the foot, the part you light, and set the wrapper about an inch and a half on the other side of your brake. So here's the brake. We're going to start here and you just wrap that a little bit right there and just as you roll it you hold the wrapper leaf and pull it toward pull the cigar towards you and just roll it. Once you get to about this point you do not want the wrapper leaf to overlap the head of the cigar so what you want to do is you want to go back about an inch and just cut it off and then continue wrapping. Once you got about an inch and a half here you want to take the goma that you put together earlier and we mixed up and just put a little bit around the edges. You don't need a whole lot. A little bit around the edges and then just keep rolling the cigar. When you get to the end, just push it down with your hand 
and you are done. How do we test it? Same way we tested it earlier. That sound is the uh, air coming from my mouth and not the cigar. Perfectly repaired cigar. Good luck.